Hello, ladies and gentlemen, Jim here, and President Trump is signing Bibles at an Alabama church and taking photos with survivors of a deadly tornado outbreak that killed nearly two dozen people, and I'm sure you're familiar with that tornado outbreak there. Now, um, volunteer Emily Pike says that the President and First Lady signed a small Bible owned by her 10-year-old daughter. Now, the mom uh, went on to say that uh, the daughter just reached out there and said, Mr. President, would you sign this? And Trump used a felt pen to scratch out his signature on the cover of the girl's Bible, which is decorated with pink camouflage. And First Lady Melania Trump then added her signature. Okay, now that's not the Bible here in this image. Now, Pike says that Trump's also signed a Bible for one of Meredith's friends. All right. Now, that may be that Bible there. Uh, the point being, folks, uh, it, it's terrific that he's there uh, with those victims in Alabama, but seriously, I, I just, I have trouble with anyone autographing a Bible. The Word of God, it's sacrosanct. Especially someone like a U.S. president who had nothing to do with the creation of the Word of God in this Bible. Um, autographing a Bible. Does that trouble you? It really troubles me. I just, and it troubles me that a Christian, even though it was a, evidently these were children that had these Bibles signed, that a Christian mom would allow the Word of God to be autographed. I, I To me, I just find it troubling. Maybe I could see if it was the Apostle Paul or someone like that, but having uh, a man autograph a Bible I don't know. Am I overreacting? I just find it very troubling. Uh, I will leave you a link to this. Please subscribe to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up and a share. Please hit the red bell icon to be notified of new video content. And please, if you would, my friends, check out the link to my book, Home A Wayfarer Story, available in Kindle and paperback. Um, I think you'll really like this if you're watching end times events, if you're watching the culture, the society, the technology. This is fiction for you folks, and I'm not sure how fictional it is, and there may be a little love in here as well. And um, I think it'd be okay for me to autograph one of these. This is not the Bible. Uh, please give it a look, my friends. But most importantly of all, do not be given over to the spirit of fear, but instead of the power of love and of a sound mind that comes through our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. God bless you.